Hey, would you like to know where I purchased my vinyl, my HTV, my sublimation blanks, and my bling bling beads and pearls that I um use to to um decorate my mugs and cups? Stay tuned and I'll show you. This is your first time visiting welcome if you've been here before thanks welcome back today i'm going to let you know where i purchased all of my things that i craft with my cricket okay i'm going to show you where i got my my get my vinyl from i'm going to show you where i get my sublimation blanks from i'm going to show you where i get my beads from and also my mugs okay are y'all ready to see I'm doing this just to help people out. People are like, why is she giving this all this good information? Because I love sharing. I love helping other people. I love um, watching other people create different things and, and um, promote their crafts, sell their crafts, whatever they want to do with it, just, or they're just making it for their family. I love it. I love helping. So let's get, to, let's get started with this video. First thing I'm going to show you is the vinyl. Okay. This is 651 vinyl. Okay. Look at this big old roll. Long sheets of tape on um, vinyl. Okay. Way much more vinyl than you would get from Michaels. Okay, this is this like I have a couple sheets here. A couple um sheets here. Let me show you the color real quick. Uh it's kind of awkward on this table. I'll do it this way. See this gray? Then I have this, like I said, it's all Oracle 61, 651, I'm sorry. Tan color. This is a gray. This is tan. And then I showed you the dark gray at first. Blue. You can see that color real good. Okay. White. Red. All these colors, different color blue. All this from 651vinyl.com. So I, I love this because you get so much vinyl. It's not expensive at all. Check the price out on, the, on their website. Because I didn't write that down. But just check out their website. It's so much different. It's so many different vinyls you can find on their website. Also use brilliantvinyl.com. Okay. But those are two sources I go to. It's cheaper to go online to purchase your vinyls. Instead of going to Michael's, Hobby Lobby, and Joanne Fabrics. They are expensive for like a little tube like this. It's only like two sheets you can use. And this is like about four sheets you can use. when you, If you cut on your 12 by 12 mat. Okay? So you, you get this little bit for like $10. $12. I'm on 14 And that's from, um, oh, this scissors. This size is like $22. Okay? At Michael's. You get this whole sheet for under six dollars if you go to the um online stores okay so yeah they do have sizes at uh, michael's i do go to michael's when i'm really in the rush trying to buy something or they have sales um 40 percent off sales 50 percent off sales i get my my um vinyl from there but other than that i'm going online here is the htv vinyl okay see how this just has the um the plain backing so this also, I got this from um, 651 Vinyl also, but you can also get this from BrilliantVinyl.com. Sorry, looking at my notes down there. Okay, so these are my vinyls. That's what I get my vinyls from. And like I said, I have a lot of Cricut vinyl too, and, and, and Sizer vinyl. And like I said, I, I purchased those for um, I purchased those from um, Michaels and Hobby Dobby, but I'm gonna stop going here if they don't have no sales i'm not going to be per by spending my money on no vinyl that's just because it's very expensive i just if i don't have time to get it from offline then that's when i go to them sorry i'm trying to put some of this stuff away so i can show you some more stuff some more goodies okay the next thing i'm gonna show you is my um beads I'm show you the beads that i blame with let me just show you this is just a few colors. I have a whole lot of beads. I mean, it's so addictive buying craft stuff. It's so addictive. Addictive. 
I just be buying stuff, but I use this stuff. Y'all know if you can see the quality of these beads. Here's the small, tiny beads. I got these from, I'll let you know if I got these from, but then I'll show you all, all of them. Okay. There's the tiny, tiny, tiny ones. I don't, know, I don't have the size on there. I think it was some green ones. I see the color. They're beautiful. And let me see. I'm going to you a couple more colors. I'll put them in the top. You can see it better in the top. Those are beautiful. Okay. Back. I'll show you some of these sky blue. Who likes blinging out cups and mugs? I love these beads. There's the purple ones. Here's some more. I'm gonna show you two mugs that I made with the beads too, just so you can get a sense of how they look on the um, product. Okay. I made these, this one. With these beads. I made this one, this cup. Okay. And this one. So you know where I got these beads from? Well, let me tell you. I got these beads from the Deco Craft. Okay, the Deco D E C O Craft K R A F T. She has X she has an Etsy page and she has the, um a, a group on Facebook. Okay, so she's I have I have like four or five receipts from her filled with uh beads that I purchased from her. So yes, I've bought a lot from her, and these are not all. I have more. So these are my receipts from her. Okay, so the next and next thing, like I said, I want to show y'all this too because I have a lot of comments in my um in, in my comment below. Where you get this from? Where you get this from? So now I'm gonna just send you right to this video so you can see where all I get my stuff from. Those are my beads. Um, these cups right here, these tumblers I got from. Yep, it's called SaveACup.com. That's where I got those tumblers from. Next thing I'm gonna show you is uh I get the whole back a box of vinyl. I'm gonna show y'all. I just got this in the mail the other day. I said I have to do a review on this because I didn't know they had well I did see some type of um pattern vinyl. But I said let me go check this out on, on Facebook. Let me go check these people out. You went there to get the vinyl with the pattern on it. Sure. Look at this. Look at this vinyl. It's gonna be so nice. And this is vinyl, okay? I got two sheets of those. And I got two sheets of these. And it's HTV vinyl. It's the pink leopard. That's gonna be pretty on some. I'm gonna do something. I might probably do a tutorial when I use these pattern pattern vinyls. Like I said, it's HTV. You gotta use heat on them. And then I was looking for some more brown vinyl for skin tones for my, you know, the women that I make on my shirts and stuff. So I bought some brown vinyl from them also. Different shades. This is also, it's, it's also HTV. And I bought me some more white glitter. HTV so I can do some more sublimation. You gotta have the white glitter for sublimation. I got that from them also. And I got, just got some black easy weed. Okay. And some plain white. That's what I got from there. I got this vinyl from I got this vinyl from Expression Vinyl. Expressionvinyl.com. They deliver it. They had fast delivery. Okay. Let's go on to the next. Let's see what else I can show you where I get purchased my stuff from. Let's go ahead and show you where I get my sublimation blanks from. Let's start off with the mop, the mugs. These are special coating mugs for sublimation. I made this one. I have so many of these that I made with different um, SVGs or PNGs on them. I got this from Kondi, C-O-N-D-E, however you pronounce it, um, dot com. 
I got, I don't know how many came in the package. I mean, in a box, but I got a full box of them. Like, I don't know how many got in, but it was like $40 for the whole box, okay? I love them. They, they're really good when it comes up, when you heat the um, mugs for sublimation, okay? And you don't have, if you, if you are doing regular vinyl mugs, get them from Dollar Store. They only a dollar, Dollar Tree. So don't buy the sublimation ones for the vinyl. Just get regular mugs from the Dollar Tree for a dollar, okay? Alrighty, so let's go ahead and move on to my sublimation blanks, y'all. I get so much stuff from this person. I'll tell you after I finish showing you. But I love sublimation. Sublimating things. I get my um luggage tags from them. I stick this it comes with a plastic strap. Okay. Here's a um makeup bag. This side is black, but this is the side that you um sublimate on. Mouse pads, fans, all this is for sublimation, guys. And I finally got my passport cover. They just came in. I can't wait to use these. I will be doing a video a tutorial on this. One side is white and the other side is pink. Let me open it up for you so you can see the inside. I got a few of these that I will be selling at charminggirlboutique.com. That's the inside of it right there. I love it. I purchased some more colors. I bought I got the black one. The black um passport cover. I think that's, that's it. We got a pink and black one. Okay. And I also got some um license plates. I want to make these also. I got a couple of those. Or the zipper on one side and white on the other side. Okay. So y'all gonna have some fun getting these out, getting these together, getting these sublimated on. I got all these from Single J's Sublimation, okay? Single J's, he's on Facebook, and he also has a website. Okay. But stay tuned, y'all, because I just found me a um, supplier. So I'm gonna be selling sublimation blanks pretty soon. I just got to go to the ship me stuff so I can test them out before I give them to my customers. So stay tuned. Stay on the lookout for some sublimation blanks from me. It'll be on my website, charminggalboutique.com. So I can get, I'm going to get all this stuff. Um, the mouse pads, the passport, that thing you just saw. I'm going to go ahead and start um, getting them from my supply. So real soon. Okay. What else I want to show y'all today? I got so much going on, y'all. I have so much going on. I have my online boutique store um, popping. I love personalized people items to, the way they like them. And I love showing y'all how I do my design. I love crafting with y'all. So my, like I said, I'm all about crafting, designing, and entrepreneurship. I um, got my boutique. I have an online boutique and I love, I love what I do. I love sh showing others how to craft our youtube channel thanks for watching thanks for supporting thanks for subscribing if you haven't subscribed please hit that subscribe button i'm really doing a lot of things to upgrade my channel y'all i'm really doing a lot so i'm gonna get to do a video on that also by the way this is my second video today i'm on the road i did a video earlier so you'll probably see me with the same dress on but yes i got some more videos coming up for you and don't and i do have your crafting videos too but i do have some entrepreneurial tips and um vlogging that i will be doing on my channel because i have three businesses i have I own my own boutique i'm the ceo of charming gap publications where i publish my own books and i'm also a daycare owner um i own amazing grace child care so i have three businesses and i love what i do and i have another thing that's coming up that i'm going to be launching soon i will be launching my own lipstick lip gloss line my own I'm gonna be making the lipstick and lip gloss myself. So I'm very excited about that because I've been doing a lot of research on that. And it's been a couple years that I've, I've really been researching, trying to figure it out. And I finally, I think I found the right formula. So I'm gonna test it out and then I'm gonna show y'all the outcome. So stay tuned to that too. Stay tuned for that also. I am a busy woman. I love being the boss, okay? I'm the boss of all my companies. I can go home when I want to. I can go in when I want to, but I love what I do. I love children. My daycare is five-star daycare. I love, I love um, 
crafting, like I said before, and I love designing. That's, those are my passions, okay? And like I said, I'm designing my own lipstick. I love um, just doing new things, being creative, creating new things. And if y'all can do it, if I can do it, y'all can do it. So whatever y'all thinking about doing, and y'all said, no, I'm going to stop. I'm going to do it next year. Quit procrastinating. Get it out there. Get your stuff out there, your ideas, whatever you have. Get it out there. Somebody wants to see it. Okay. I've been, I had an online, I had a um, boutique store. I'm going to do a video about that too, about how I had to close that down because of things went on. But I'm going to talk to you about that too in, my, in one of my blogs for um entrepreneur. So I'm not just making this stuff up where I never, or it's not like I never, you know, went down that road. I've been down that road. I have businesses. I have brick and mortar. I had a brick and mortar store. Okay. I have a daycare center with six employees. So I am... I know what I'm talking about when I'm saying, let me talk about, let me blog about these entrepreneurial, um, you know, things that people need to know when they're going into business. So I've been doing this for a while. Like I said, my, um, I've been writing books for like 10 years and I've been doing daycare for like 10 years. I've been, my store, my boutique, I've been selling for like eight years online, brick and mortar stores. I've just been doing, you know, doing a lot of different things. So. Um, and I did have a makeup, I did have a lipstick line before, but it was nothing I made. It was just a um, private label company. I just put my label on there and I was like, Ooh, I got my name on here. But now I'm going to be coming out with my own lipstick and lip gloss that I'm going to be batching up. Okay. And, um, get it out to y'all. So <laughs> blogs is going to be called entrepreneur her. Okay. All my blogs on, um, entrepreneurship and stuff is going to be called entrepreneur her. And what I'm going to be bringing up coming up soon is it's going to be called real talk. I'm going to let y'all business women know how I just spend crazy, crazy money on all these clothes and stuff that I bought from my brick and mortar store and I had to shut it down because I went over my head. Okay, so stay tuned to that. I will be um, talking about that pretty soon. If you have any questions or comments, leave them below. Oh, let me show you this. I bought these from Walmart. My little purple poly polymellers. So I'm gonna be able to ship my lipstick line. See, I'm already, I'm already preparing myself. Yes, you gotta, you gotta prepare yourself for what's coming up for the great. Okay. I bought these because I'm gonna be shipping all my lipsticks and my um lip gloss in. And I am um my color's purple. My, you can see my logo and everything. So I got these. You know I love purple, so I have to get also get a new thing for my a cover for my macbook so i got this i had it one like this but it's got dirt it got dirty so i got a new a new one to get fresh okay y'all um and i got these both of these from amazon and i also got me some thank you cards because when i do ship off my stuff from, to my um people i know this is a whole nother video but i'm gonna show you another video about that too about um different things you need to um start your business and how to have a business different things you need the the things you need to start up a business online boutique or any kind of store I'm gonna have a video on that showing you the things you need. I got these little cards, the glares for my light. And I can just put these when I purchase, when um somebody buy my items, I pack this up in, with their um, oh, with their stuff. And I just personalize it with them, telling them thank you for shopping at my boutique. Okay, I got that and that, what else I get? Like I said, I'm upgrading. I'm, I got a video coming up about how I'm upgrading my channel. I'm, um, like I said, I'm um, monetized now, so, I'm going from, I was being simple and now I'm upgrading to better, okay? From, you know, getting ring lights, getting um, tripods, getting stuff that I need to make my videos more professional, more better for you to watch, okay? So I hope y'all enjoy my videos. I hope y'all like what I do and I hope y'all see that I'm trying to build up. Now, I don't like to stay where I started. I like to build up and um, get better at the things that I do. So let me see. Stay tuned to Char Charming Gal. Lip gloss and lipsticks. Stay tuned for Andrea Paher when I'm gonna be blogging and just telling you things that I went through being the owner of a brick and mortar store. And stay tuned for more videos of crafting and designing, okay? I appreciate the love. Comment below, give me your website so we can check you out and see you in the next video.